So here I am talking to the fucking phone for like 10 minutes and I'm not even recording. And I don't even remember what the fuck I was saying, so I'm not starting over. <laughs> it's Saturday, January 28th, 2023. I'm on my way to band practice and driving through downtown Seattle right now. And it is so sad to see the amount of fucking trash that has accumulated on the sides of the freeways, in the hills. I mean, there are some tent communities, like I just saw one that has like recycling and garbage. I don't know who's, how, there's not an address there, maybe someone is just, maybe the city is just giving them one, I don't know, but on the other side of the freeway, they don't have that shit because it's just trash all over the ground, it's, it's kind of sad, it didn't used to be like this, I remember growing up, um, there's always been some homeless people, but not nearly as much as there is now. I mean, at least back then there was so few homeless people that, you know, there was enough space for people to just like sleep in abandoned building, um, doorways and some businesses I remember would open up the doors for them to crash, you know, in the little lobby area or the in between the uh, the business door and the outside door, you know, how it has that little weird area. I remember working at Sabaro's Pizza when I was like 15, I think I was 15 or 16, at the mall downtown at the West Lake Mall. And at the end of the evening, um, when we were about to close, um, there'd be like a couple um, homeless people that would come and we would give them our leftover pizza instead of throwing it away. Um, once I realized that that was okay to do, I started purposely making some pizza towards the end so that they can have some fresh pizza. Like, And also whatever we didn't give away, we could just take home. I was always taking home pizza. So that's probably why I don't like pizza. So sick of pizza. <laughs> All we had growing up as a teenager was fucking pizza. My mom would order us pizza like almost every night because we didn't have a car. Um, we lived too far from, I mean, we could take the bus, but come on, taking the bus and getting a pizza and picking it up, like that's too much work. I remember in Bremerton living up a hill so far up that in the winter the buses refused to go up it so we'd have to walk all the way down the hill to get to the bus. And by that time I would just walk all the way to the fucking parking ride because it was like a mile down the hill and half a mile around the corner it was like the parking ride where I can where that bus was gonna take me to take another bus. So I've been pretty much my whole life taking public transportation up until well I guess the last 10 years because I mean I've had a car but sometimes I don't mind taking public transportation because you can get where you're going faster you don't have to worry about parking there's so many benefits to it. My biggest issue now, though, is why I won't take... Oh, 
Okay, now I don't know what I was talking about. <laughs>